as a brief, uh, brief demo. Uh, this is the back side, this is a power, power input port, this one. This is a auto inlet port and this is a power on switch. For start of the machine, just push this button on. Machine is started. There are four oper different operating modes. Nozzle setup, bubble setup, HFNC and auto resuscitation. Now we briefly discuss about the circuit attachment. First of all, put the humidifier chamber to the humidifier. Then simple, short the inspiratory link one, connect to the inspiratory port of the machine. And second port is connected to the humidifier chamber. Now rest of the circuit has two parts, one is an inspiratory lamp which is a heated wire inside the, that's blue one, it's connected on the humidifier chamber and the second one without humid, uh, heated wire circuit will connect to the machine expiratory port. The circuit attachment is completed for nozzle setup and auto resuscitation mode. For starting of nozzle setup, just click on the nozzle setup. The current situation is showing the real time pressure, whatever the PP is set on the screen. Uh, required flow is set from this air and auto flow meter accordingly to the FIO2 and flow according to calculate this on chart. Required PP will be set from the machine's PWP knob. Okay. For stop the therapy, just click on this yellow stop button. And if you want to stop therapy and click on yes. Uh, second mode is a bubble CPAP mode. For bubble CPAP you have to connect expiratory limb to the bubble CPAP generator and set a required pressure from here. Currently we set a 5 of CPAP from bubble CPAP generator. Now just click on the bubble CPAP and the real time pressure was showing on the screen and the bubbling is from here. So, there are no leak in the circuit. If any kind of leak available in the system, then bubble is not generating here. For activating alarm limit, just simple on this bell icon, uh, set the lower pressure limit and the upper pressure limit and just simple enable the alarm. So, we have enable our alarm. And for disable, just simple go to the settings and disable the alarm. For stop the therapy, just simple click on stop and stop the button. Now for auto resuscitation, okay, uh, we are going on uh, HFNC mode. So in HFNC simple, we have to connect uh, inspiratory to the humidifier and humidifier to the uh, heated wire circuit. And in front of, we have just connect to our uh, HFNC cannula and just required flow will uh, set from this flow meters. Last stop. Okay. And last more. For auto resuscitation mode, we have to connect expiratory limb to the expiratory of machine. Just click on auto mode. Uh, set inspiratory time as you required. Uh, expiratory time as you require then the calculated rate and i ratio will be showing on the screen for peep uh, just click on the peep button and set from this peep knob a desired peep then confirm up okay after that click on pip required peep will be shared from the pip knob and confirm after that just start display button so deliver the real time pressure whatever we set again the simple lrm limit will be shared from the here if any kind we have to change, uh, just click on this setting button to set the required changes in the inspiratory and expiratory time. For stopping, just simple click on the stop. Okay. For FI2 chart, we have also included in the on screen. So just click on this calculated symbol. Uh, required flow from total flow. Uh, reference FI2, let's say we have set 60% FI2 and just click on the find. So it is calculated the 3 liter of air and 3 liter of O2 flow from the earth. So we can go total 6 liter of flow and 60% of FI2 and just click that. Okay. Uh, real time pressure on screen battery status will showing on here. 
it is currently on mains if we are putting on battery the status will be changed on mains to on battery and the battery percentage is showing in his ear Mm. Additionally, we can set the brightness and all from the settings. So from here, we can set our uh, screen brightness and all. If we are uh, total operating hours, will be showing here. Okay, thank you.